Good morning everyone, welcome to Slim Chat. It's Tracy and um, I don't know the number, I can't remember it. I think it might be 138 but I can't be sure. It's around that kind of mark I reckon. Anyway, <clears throat> yesterday I was cutting out the sugar. I kind of failed a little bit but I'm getting there. I didn't have very much. It was really a very small amount. So I'm still on track for um, you know, doing what I said I was going to do, and cutting things out and then getting back on in the swing of things. I think it's hard, you know, it is hard when you, when you, when you're trying to first get that, kick that, and get in the zone. It is difficult. I will get there because, you know, I hate what I have done to myself. <laughs> I do, really hate it. It's yesterday as well, this is another incentive. I did a live stream over on Crochet Rocks and during that live stream I had a bit of an attack of allergies and my lips were itching. I've never had this before where they were really itching. You know, I had hoped they'd give me that beauty pout but then they didn't. But I just itched like crazy and <clears throat> I kept doing this. I was a bit tight in the chest and wheezy and my nose was itching, my, my mouth was itching. And um, it may have been something that I'd eaten that had triggered it, but I just drank um, um, Cherry Pepsi Max, which, I mean, I drink that all the time and I've never had any reaction to it. So I think it was probably something I'd eaten before I did the live stream. And um, all of the things were meant to be dairy-free, so I just don't understand it. But whatever it is, um, what I'm actually looking forward to, I'm sorry but I've got hair, it's really annoying me. Um, what I'm really looking forward to, just bear with me a sec, this will hopefully get rid of it. What I'm really hoping is that as soon as I get stuck into the diet, all those things that I'm allergic to will um, will be a thing of the past. You know, they'll, they'll just go. That's the theory anyway, but <clears throat> just need to get in the zone so difficult after Christmas to get in the zone very annoying you just wish you could click your fingers some people can and I think also some people like me you know at times in your life you get to a point where you've just had enough and you can't do it any longer well I'm obviously not quite there eh, still tempted away by small things but luckily I was pretty good all day it was only the evening that always used to be my failing time as well evenings but um it's almost gone and plus i had i did have a drink last night i just when gary got home so he come home fairly early and we both had a, a drink watching him get killed by aliens and well they're not aliens there they're zombie kind of things but he was playing his game i can't i don't know why but i quite like watching him play it not all the time obviously because it's like a really crap movie where the hero dies a lot. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I do like him playing it. <laughs> so, smell and taste have come back a little more. Not perfect though. But I do see an improvement all the time, which is good. And last night I didn't have any tiredness, but that just might be because I was distracted. Um, by doing tutorials for my other channel and then I did a live stream so it, it kind of kept me up if you like and then I did find it hard to get off to sleep which is half the course for me so I was awake till two which is really kind of my normal thing you know I'd either go to sleep if I'm tired around midnight ish or two if I'm not um, sometimes that can drag on and I hate that but um that's when I tend to get up really late so hopefully that won't happen too much more now but it's been really out of kilter my sleep pattern I always like to say out of whack been out of whack but um so today I have no idea what we're having for dinner I know we've got some of the the meat left from our uh, roast the other day but there's not massive amounts so and I ate the veg so I don't really want to have that again. But I wanted to say, oh, you know, 
I'll have egg and bacon get in the swing of it all. But I can't really taste egg. So uh, it's, it's a bit bland. Oh, I'll work it out. There's lots of stuff in the freezer. Nothing out, though. <clears throat> so I have to dash out today, do some errands. I have to send back something and um, go and do a few errands. It's freezing outside. Not very nice weather. It's all rainy or sleety, whatever that is out there. And it's freezing. So I'm not really looking forward to it. Um, but I have to go. So I'm going to get this uploaded. I know it's not very long, but um, apart from you know cutting down gradually I've not really got much else to tell you apart from the allergy but there you go um things will improve I will get there I'll get in the zone I'll get all the gradual cutting down done and um get on it because I'm not happy with the fact that you know I'd lost all that weight and you know I'd got the debilitating disease <laughs> and it had made me lose even more and then I went and screwed it up never mind I needed to get back on my feet and stronger <clears throat> well that's what I'm telling myself anyway thanks for watching stay safe take care and I will see you later if you want to join me for a live stream over on crochet rocks then please do I think I probably will do one unless the only thing that stopped me is whether the tiredness then just floods over me and I end up you know, like one of those zombies on Gary's game. So stay safe and I'll see you soon.